Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Recreating. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the Cuddle Team Leader by Mick Farland. Uh, this beauty is pretty nice, but there is one difference between the toy and the actual video game. And I'll point that out. Stay tuned. Alright guys, so we're going to do a little review of the Cuddle Team Leader from Fortnite. Um, this one is a McFarlane toy. Uh, I love McFarlane toys. He always has a bunch of detail in his toys. I love his toys. There's one thing that he left out out of this character, and I'll point that out um, towards the end of the video. After once we do our review of the whole thing, um, the little box looks really nice. Uh, in the back, you can see all the characters that are already out. Um, here, look, they look like the characters that are coming out pretty soon. Um, this looks like Rex. It looks like and then this one uh, it kind of looks like drift but I'm not 100% sure about that one uh, this one looks like the bright bomber and this one mm, they could either be um, either Omega or I don't know what do you guys think it is leave a comment down below who you think is I think it's Omega because of the little spikes in his head it looks like Omega and then here you could have your Fortnite um, battle axes um, also available I have never seen this one I've seen this one in person but I've never seen this one uh, I don't know but anyways looks really nice so uh, without any further ado let's get right into the package it's got some tape over here on the side let me take the tape out okay tapes off Slide right out as you guys can see in there there's a little stand in there you can see me in the reflection, hi guys. Anyways, there's a little stand in there. I don't know if you guys can see it in there. But I'm not gonna take that out yet. We're gonna look at the toys, see what they have. Oh, it's pretty loud. Anyways, uh, the acoustics in here is pretty awesome. <laughs> but there's our battle axe, the little infamous uh, unicorn that looks like the loot llama. But it's a unicorn, that's her battle axe. It's pretty cool. A bow that goes in the back of her. That's the side. And here is her gun. Nice little detail to it. I like the texture. This is what I like about McFarlane's toys. I kind of prefer McFarlane's toys over NECA toys. I don't know, man. McFarlane's been, you know, doing his stuff and really good detail every once in a while you get like a little paint uh, splot right there but other than that I mean look at the details on this like a looks pretty nice now let's take her out it's really loud <laughs> okay so here she is articulation is pretty awesome it's got at first when you first get it out it's, it's kind of hard joints the joints are pretty hard to if you guys could hear that but I mean after a while I guess of use you could actually take that out it looks like she has ball joints down there she's about to get birth anyways uh, I hope you guys aren't kids <laughs> I guess if you guys are look like she broke her arm look my arm but anyways so articulation is pretty good it's up and down side to side it looks like she has another little ball joint here if you guys could pick that up there in the camera you see a little joint that goes back and forth up and down and then her little shoulder also goes up and down her, her biceps back and forth now she has a double joint right here at the elbow it's pretty nice because you get that whole turn uh, the hand obviously is in the ball joint so you can see that and then the head you get full articulation side to side up and down it's also on the ball joint it's really nice you can see the detail on the on the neck same thing obviously with the other arm there's the arm to hold the gun the face looks awesome all around beautiful scope look at the detail on this thing it's so nice McFarlane you are awesome 
So anyway, this is a little bowl that goes in the back. There you go. Just the back of her. Oh, uh, let me continue on with the the joints. So she has a little swerve right there. Turn of the hips. Up and down. Side to side. There you go. And like I said, ball joints there. At the knees, she has double jointed again. Like the arms, which is really nice. Also on the feet. It has a ball joint. As you guys can see, a little ball joint there. But for some reason, it doesn't go side to side. It's pretty hard to go side to side. But for the most part, it goes up and down. So that's really what matters. Same thing on the other side. She has the shin guards. Uh, with straps all the way around. Look at the detail on the straps. If my camera focuses, oh, there you go. Um, you guys can see all the little detail on the straps. The color on the boots are a nice shiny pink. Uh, the really, really nice details on this thing. It's got the buttons on the back. Uh, it makes it look even, it's just really, really good. So then, you put her gun. And you put her finger on the trigger, which is really nice. Fits it perfectly fine. And then on the other hand, you can boot. Get it. Oh, there goes one thing that I don't like. <laughs> it's pretty hard to put the, the pickaxe, and our pickaxe is pretty heavy. This is pretty heavy. It's almost the same size, the same uh, weight as the actual character itself. So it's kind of like it's hard for her to hold. I guess she holds it down like that. It's pretty badass. So yeah, there she goes. Um, so anyways, we wanted, what I wanted to tell you guys that it's missing on this character as what's different between this character and the actual character from Fortnite. Well, let me tell you what it is. And it is that. <laughs> the butt on her is flat. As you guys could see from the side. Completely flat, but there's no butt there. There is no cake. <laughs> there's no butt there. Uh, you can see the crack, but I mean, that doesn't mean anything. It's the light hitting it. But as if you see it from the side, there's no butt. If you see the Fortnite character on the game, which I put here side by side, you guys will see that uh, there's a bigger butt on the actual ga uh, game itself than there is on the character. Um, why did it do that? I have no idea. Um, I don't know why I'm emphasizing on that. <laughs> uh, that sounds uh, pretty uh, not suitable for kids <laughs> when I point that out. But I mean, it's it's obvious. Like if you look at the character, it's it's obviously there. Uh, most male character, most male uh, Fortnite players usually look at the butt. Even the female characters. There's a bunch of uh, videos out there that look at the female character butts, and they see that. Uh, uh, that's why they they like Fortnite, I guess. But uh, I just wanted to point that out for you guys because there's a big difference. So, anyways, for those of you who are interested in that type of stuff. But other than that, there is nothing uh, nothing else that I that I I'll rip apart because everything else is like beautiful, beautifully detailed. Everything, even the belt, it's really nice. Um, the backpack, the, the the fur on the on the um, body all over the body looks really really nice uh, the head the head's a little bit loose like it looks like a bobblehead but I mean and that, that doesn't bother me at all the color in the eyes uh, those are pink eyes and that's a purple eye um, yeah, everything's everything's legit except for that <laughs> but I mean that doesn't bother me it, it's it's i just wanted to point it out for those of you who are interested in that type of stuff but uh, other than that it's pretty nice and it, look at the detail on the wrist watch or the little wrist uh, band pretty nice so anyways guys that's my review on uh cuddle team leader i hope you enjoyed this little um review of cuddle team leader if you did please don't forget to hit the like button 
if you're new to the channel don't forget to subscribe because all we do here is art art toys uh paintings drawings pencil drawings uh, actual paints whatever it is it doesn't matter if it's art you're gonna see it on this channel uh, polymer clay tutorials and all that good stuff uh, if you guys are into that don't forget to subscribe hit the little bell notification on the side because that will notify you every single time i do a video and you guys will be the first to oh, you guys will be the first to watch it so thank you guys so much again for watching uh if you guys subscribe you guys will see me on the next one peace